today is the day. So me and Jed finally move in together today, which I'm so excited for. He's currently just in the car with Wendy and Saffron because they are driving down. Because obviously Jed's moving out of his house. Like I've kind of been moved out for the past years because obviously I've been doing uni. I'm just obviously like now just moving in with my boyfriend for the final year. Um, it's just gonna be so fun. Like we're so excited. But obviously Jed's moving out from home, which is like such a big thing. My camera's already flashing. Jed has my chargers. What a nightmare. But I basically just wanted to jump on here, say hi and say today's the day. Let's move out. And we are in. Um, Saffron. Saffron and Wendy have just left. They're gonna come back a little later, but we're just gonna do some homeware shopping. I don't know whether to give a tour now or in a little bit. I think I'm gonna do it in a little bit purely because my camera is about to die. And I'm gonna Is talk this really the beginning now. of your video? No. Oh, I, I just, think you should put the tour in now. We'll film it later. Okay, we'll film it now. We'll put it in now. We'll but just because my later. camera's about to die, I did just give Jed his moving in presents. I've got these oh, yeah. robes and they're so, so large. Yes. Like they're so thick. And they also have hoods. I was saying to Jed, like, I didn't want to get him a hood because, like, it's just on the slightly feminine kind of side. But then um, if she got a hood without me, I would have been fuming. So exactly. I'm glad. <laughs> but yeah, we also got these like move in presents. I'll show you all of them later. Oh, actually, they're here. Um, how cute! So you got little um bottles, but yeah, love. Okay, we have fast forward a few days, but it's just so I can backtrack to give you a tour. So, since I would have last spoken to you, me and Jed have literally just been unpacking things. It took me a while to get into my wardrobe, I won't lie. Um, yeah, quite the while, just like reorganizing, see how much I can get packed in there. Don't mind my hair, I slept with it just like wet last night, and now I don't really know what to call this so we're just gonna have to move on from that but yeah flat tour let's just jump straight into it because obviously i know i would have spoken you guys through bits and bobs okay so as we walk through the door we have this really big hallway where we've literally still got mess because we don't know what to do with our suitcases mine is actually currently broke it was that one it broke on the way to Bali, which was brill. Um, I'm taking this home today though, just because I'm going home for a little while. Well, like two days, just because I need to see my sister before she travels the world. We've got some boxes here. Jed refuses to get rid of his trainer boxes, so we're not quite sure we're doing that, but we've got this here. There was a full length mirror here, but we just moved it around there just because I did some ad work the other day. And then we've got this cupboard here, which has our, like all our central heating, uh, air con, that kind of thing. And then the washing machine with our lovely products on top. I'm thinking, you're probably getting like a little some kind of storage just so it's a bit neater Jed's shoes are stored there and then as we walk in we walk into the bedroom again it's not super clean I will not lie to you that's the only box I got left guys it's just that box and then I'm fully in that's all I can really say so this is what the bedroom looks like it's really quite plain right now like I'm not quite sure how much we're gonna do with it because I kind of enjoy the simplicity then we've got my wardrobe I've just currently got this dress out because I think I might wear it to our ladies day back where I live and then this is what the wardrobe is currently looking like if you follow my tiktok and stuff you would have seen I did like a sunday reset where I kind of sorted it all out Jed's got his wardrobe there and then another chest of drawers and then we've got this absolutely amazing view um i'm not going to open this door just because we'll go around the other side but this does open up onto the balcony so you can kind of access the balcony from our bedroom or our living room so walking out across the hall we have the bathroom um which i absolutely love like i just think it's such a nice bathroom we've got like two different light which is really nice it is what's it called i've just got my ipad here because i've just been doing uh watching some youtube whilst i did my makeup for the day really nice shower um i was actually watching it diary of a ceo grace beverly romy just introduced me to grace beverly I don't know how I've gone this long without knowing her. What a woman, I will say that. Um, but yeah, we've got all our products in here. We've got extra storage down there. So like bathroom wise, it's brilliant. We've got so much in here. We've got our towel rack, our robes, shampoo. Um, that's the bathroom. And then walking through the hallway. This is the bag that's actually going home. Basically, guys, I'm putting so much on Depop. I really am, just because I'm having a big clear out. I also feel like I'll literally do this clear out and then have another one because it'll be winter time. This is the mirror that I was on about. This was the mirror that went in the hallway. I quite like it here. I know it's really bad lighting, but I just love the background. Um, but yeah, we probably are gonna move it back just because it really opens up the hallway. So you've got this lovely table. Now, um, if anyone asked me where, like, so like loads of people saying like, oh my God, where's the sofa? from i genuinely couldn't tell you because everything in here came partly furnished so like this table and chairs i really couldn't tell you so we've got this lovely little dining area um your standard tv setup type thing we've got two storages down there which is really nice as well so this is view number one if i can open this door oh it's so hot out um so as you can so this is the view now 
there is a construction site down here which is obviously really annoying but like i feel like half the time when you're in london there is just construction anywhere they said that by the time like we've kind of like moved out that it won't get to our level anyways i don't even think they have the permits like the air rights to come up anyways but yeah we've got the o2 over there literally all the planes are like jetting off which is really cute and then we've got the canary wharf wharf <laughs> So that's that and then yeah so this is it's hard to like show you because i've actually realized the camera screen is so small um so this is our little lounging area this is view number two which is by far my absolute favorite like it's just so gorgeous um and there's those oh my god you see my toes <laughs> um but you can um see all of the what's it called the boats and things stroll by which is really cute like that i want that <laughs> i'm like yeah i'll have you you and you i will never have that in a million dreams really really gorgeous and then this is what the kitchen is looking like so we've got this really big open space which we're thinking like oh it might be nice maybe to move this over here but we really don't want to clutter things like we love how just like simple and just clean and fresh um well it's i, I say clean it's really not looking too clean right now um but we will get there so then we've got all of our kitchen space which is really nice the fridge is actually huge which i'm thoroughly enjoying it's looking quite empty at the moment but we keep doing this thing which i absolutely love but that kind of concludes the tour just because yeah i'll give you any updates i've actually got a i'm really excited um i managed to persuade jed you know this little section here there's loads of plugs so i was like oh what can we do and we've only got one lamp in here currently and we've got these under lights but other than that it's quite dark in here in the evenings um so i've got a drinks cart coming which i'm really really excited about just to like have some cocktail glasses on um some books romy the other day got me this absolutely stunning um housewarming present which is just this vogue book and i just know that it would look absolutely perfect here so other than that like that's the only furnishing plans i've got at the moment i'm gonna get some like more cushion throws and things like that for the bedroom just like overall decoration because i feel like furniture wise we really are quite like lucky in the fact that we're quite set up but yeah that is it i hope you have enjoyed this little video i am probably gonna i just like talking to you guys i don't know why i'm always like when i go back to editing i edit down so much and it's just because i don't shut up like i don't know why i'm just like hi guys like how are you like i don't know i don't know but yeah um I'll let you carry on with the rest of the video. I hope you enjoy. And then this is what the living area looks like. It's literally so lovely. Coffee, wine through there, more tables. Um, and then our gym is down there. So me and Jenna just in John Lewis. We've just got our scones. <laughs> Don't know why we've decided to do this, but I was actually starving. Wrong day to choose this outfit. This, <laughs> they're shorts, like it's a score. But obviously John Lewis demographic is on the slightly she elder side. <laughs> That I'm getting, I'm just like, just let me be. It's a cute outfit ish. I don't know, babe. Do you want a smoothie maker? I feel like we can maybe get one on Amazon for cheaper. But honestly, guys, we're having the best time of our lives. This is at, well, I am. I don't know about Jed. I think, no, I think Jed is enjoying it. You're enjoying it, aren't you, babe? Yes. <laughs> Um, but I don't know, this is just so exciting, it's so fun. I can't make this up, me and Jed have just been here for the last like half an hour, putting our heads on all the pillows, like feeling all the duvets. That's not a nice pillow. Is it not? No. It's so funny though, Jed's just got so much like funny vlog footage. Um, <laughs> it's really quite funny. Yeah, pretty much. I've got steak, so I'm just waiting for my steak to come. Is it the chicken amazing? It's so yum. But yeah, I think we're having dinner at the apartment, but just because it needs to, lovely ladies come up, we might as well just go have dinner out together. So we just come to Parma Jane for dinner. Oh my god. Isn't the chicken it's so, so good? It's so like, yum. The chicken is bang on. So you just kind of like pick up everything. But honestly, it's so, so yummy. I'm really, really so sorry. I feel like everything I've filmed so far in this vlog has been on my phone because our batteries keep dying. We're just going to wind down this evening. Wendy and Stefan Kylie got us some hotel chocolate dipping set. So we're going to do that this evening. But yeah, just have our first night in the apartment. Guys, I can't even explain to you how happy this has all made me. Like, me and Jen just feel so happy like i think that's literally just like pure happiness is all we're feeling right now um we really are absolutely loving it loving life feeling grateful that we're able to do this i also um i think it's a new hair brand or i don't know i haven't necessarily heard of it before but rehab actually sent me this the other day how gorgeous is that um so these little scrunchies that i just put in my hair um are actually from them because obviously silk's meant to be the best for your hair but i think that's just so cute like even I don't know, just with everything, I just absolutely love that. Um, it came with a hairbrush, which Wendy also got this PR, and she says that this hairbrush is the best thing she's ever used, so I've got high expectations for that. Um, one of these, which I have never tried before, so let me know if I should try it out. I 
think it's, I look so weird right now, but it's the um, that sleep thing that will like heatlessly curl your hair. Some of these, which I absolutely love. Floor clip in this really nice color. And then obviously they, and then obviously their hair oil serums yet to figure out how because they're the um these kind of types of yet to figure out how to put these into my hair but we'll go with it but yeah thank you to rehab really excited to obviously test all of that out like i was saying makeup's got a cloth um i also bought me and jed the brooms yesterday i went um into london with Romy and i saw these and i was like we have to pick them up guys I can't even explain how nice they are. It's toweling material, but like it's so soft, I can't even explain. And good morning, everyone. We had the best night last night. We were both just smiling from ear to ear. It was such just, just like a great feeling to be like, yeah, we've done that. We've moved in together. Um, yeah, we're both over the moon. They're just doing some work. Yeah, I'm just editing, so I'm waiting for him to just shut up so I can carry on. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm actually off to the old house so I can basically pick all my stuff. Mum's driving down from Nottingham, bless her. I look like an actual little boy right now, but that's fine. The hair just isn't it. So yeah, let's go pack up my life for the past year from the other house. Um, I don't know if that made any sense. Now I get to say bye-bye, second year uni room. Um, oh, I'm so out of breath. The two flights of stairs really... Have killed us this today all done obviously this is now going all back up to nottingham so i can either donate it depop it or put it in my wardrobe at home just it feels nice just to like fully be done and just to move into the other flat like i can't explain i'm so happy that now everything is just in the house we are just about to head off to ikea which is really exciting gonna write a big list in the car we just have been having some deliberations about uh, what color schemes yeah. where things are going we'll be doing a little bit of measuring had a little argument about where a chest of drawers is going so it's, it's, all, it's all fun and games you've really got to play it like jenga sometimes but yeah it's just fun um so yeah i'll see you in ikea oh i might get some food in ikea place is right directly underneath us they have peach juice so i'm going to grab some in a minute um but yeah it's literally all these amazing delicatessen food styles um you can literally get like fresh pasta everything i'll show you some more in a minute and then this is all the fresh pasta that i was telling you about you can literally get fresh, fresh fish um they've got those steaks there um and then you walk around and there is a whole like bakery style area um which has ice cream as well oh it looks so amazing literally look at it like why is this directly below me i'm going to get so fat i have indeed just come to ikea and gone to the canteen first off this lighting really is a bit harsh on the food but so excited also got the jam i used to hate this but it is so so good i don't like jed's got a little kid bottle of gravy because i wanted it on his side and mum has got some like goat cheese tart thing i also treat myself to a little cinnamon roll because they're the best from ikea but please start a common debate section whether you choose a jam or gravy or whether like jam is just wrong but jam and chips and the meatballs are oh, it's just it's unmatchable this boy is just not okay one he's eating gravy from a little bowl two is with a fork <laughs> yeah, look, I've done it, you enjoying that mm. really yum <laughs> really good. We're on to our next dilemma. It's cupboard talk. We're on to our next dilemma. It's about cupboards. Um, we can't choose between two different heights. Basically, it's the whole dilemma of whether we want a cupboard um, for Jed for more storage in the bedroom or in the hallway. Because in the bedroom at the moment, we have this vanity I area. I have bedroom, so I don't have to run around looking for my clothes every day. Which makes sense, but the vanity looks really, really lovely in the bedroom and it kind of like separates the space. It's a bit more spacious. So I was thinking this storage to be in the hallway. To be fair though, like, I'd, I'd happily sacrifice. I'd have all my pants in the hallway. I couldn't give a shit. Part of my French. I just, I'm very torn. I know what I want, that's the problem. I'm yeah, Jed's like, I'm a bit more, I'll consider other options, whereas Jed's like, nah. He's so stubborn that I just can't work with him. I'm not stuck, like, I, I've said no. yes to everything you've asked for today. Jed, go on and look at that little tiny one there. I'm, I'm I have asked. As well as. So Judge has gone. Oh, well, I've said yes to everything you've asked for. I've asked for these, right. which we need, <laughs> and a grocery shopping bag, which is my personal preference. And the colour cutlery, the the pillow colours that she wants. Right, the, we ha we've said we're going to leave pillows. Cutlery we've wise, it. we've gone we've for silver. What other cutlery we've did you got want? The no, no, no. Listen, what other cutlery did you want to go for? Yellow. I'm just, I'm just saying I'm not stubborn. 
Like, I am stubborn, but I'm not as stubborn as you. My mum's watching us. Thinking, I think oh, you're more stubborn God. than anyone in the world. Go and have a look at that candle, Jed. It's nice. <laughs> I know, I've seen it. Oh, we have for hours. So I've said to Jed that he can choose the pots and the patterns, but oh my God. He's walking around with a little pout on his face, like, hmm, feeling the weights of them. Look at <laughs> Do you find one? Huh? Is it an induction? It's an induction. So it to have no, it's not an induction. an induction. Why is it an induction? I thought it was an induction. What does induction mean? Well, you've got to have certain bottoms. To your you have to have induction things normally, but I'm pretty sure it's induction that you don't need. But it, it's the exact same as the one we got home, which is induction. But we so how do we know what these ones are? Oh, honestly, guys, adulting is just too hard. This don't don't come and try it. Just, just leave so adulting for other induction. people because oh. Which just leave it behind guys four hours later and i think i repeat i think we fit well obviously we have finished we're in checkout i don't know what we're about um but yeah jed's not too happy because obviously that took a lot of time <laughs> actually so sad we've just walked out with these absolutely beautiful glasses um the small ones and like a regular size what are you doing in the background Jed? Oh, I need my what are you doing little gremlin <laughs> But look, I'm actually so sad. One already smashed because then the way that the trolley and the gravel was, we were being so careful, like literally going so slowly and it still smashed. So really sad now. Little Mr. Handyman in here. Although I did just have to um, stop him from... Oh, she says one thing, honestly. <laughs> no, me and mum walked back in from um, being out and basically he had, which ones was it? He had these ones. I only had Basically one one. like this. So they're diagonal, screwing through these holes, thinking, that that was gonna act as a draw. God knows how. Guys, honestly, I'm drained. I got <laughs> in and I've straight away done this. <laughs> Go away. I made one little mistake. Like a barley bear. <laughs> yeah, I don't blame her to be fair. Because, I don't blame her to be fair because I'm absolutely shattered. I can't explain how much lifting, walking up and down flights of stairs, traipsing through IKEA. Like we've done so much today. Um, we're now debating whether to, because we wanted to do a really big food shop today, but we're now debating whether to maybe go and get food for this evening and then do a bigger shop tomorrow. We don't know, but I will give you an IKEA haul now. I love the bits and bobs that we got. It was mostly essentials. We were kind of a bit like, we obviously do want to furnish this place, like to make it a bit more homely, like bed cushions and bed throws and things like that. Um, but I think we might do that from a home just so we can kind of like see our bed see the picture online see if it matches type thing whereas when we were in ikea we were trying to in our head then picture if it would go and things like that um so just to get the interior all nice we're gonna do that from home i think but yeah i'll show you the ikea bits now <gasps> okay so the big bit that we did get was obviously the chest of drawers that was only the really piece of like furniture we did need because obviously i love the sofa um, we were thinking about getting a new one, but we were like, why would we need to? Like, it came free pre furnished, and I absolutely love the sofa. So, let's go through the haul. We've got the necessities. I was about to got some sponges. These are the plates we picked up, and oh my god, I'm actually so obsessed with them. Jed wanted like plain white, white plates, but for some reason that really scares me, and I don't know why. Just plain white plates. I feel like these look a lot more like nicer when you put food in them, like aesthetics wise as such. We, are, we have very much gone for a very white, grey, black that kind of thing but like slightly on the more warm side that's the light's kind of cold i don't know like this um we also got these for tea and coffee i did buy the tea and coffee pots yesterday but when we came back they don't really match the toaster and the kettle which sounds really extra but when it's all together it's just like it's like an ick so yeah these are all our plates um we did actually steal them from the display because there were only ones left and the woman kind of called it called us out on it um, when we went to check out but that's the story for another day. Your practicals, but again, we've literally gone for like the black and the chrome. Um, I love these glasses. We have these at home, um, and especially because I'm thinking about getting a coffee machine. But guys, let me know which coffee machines are good because we've got one at home, um, which is like really good. But like, I'm like, could we get? I don't know. I really like the one at home. I'm just like, is there a better one? Like, I want to hear the review. So let me know what coffee machine is the best. But yeah, I love these coffee glasses so much. We picked up some knives. It was so funny when we were in the knife section. Um, Jed was actually like covering his eyes because he has this weird thing about his eyes go really funny when he like sees any pointy objects. Um, we got these for pasta. Um, I think we got two of those. Yeah, we did. I think we're gonna have one for fusely um, and one for the pasta. Um, again, another knife. We got two knives purely because we are tempted to get a knife block. I feel like they look so lovely on the side, but we were there and obviously we didn't know if it was gonna match this kind of wood. Honestly, I'm probably gonna sound so OCD right now, but like everything does have to like match or be on the same tonal scale, otherwise I'll just cry. Especially because moving in, like this place seems so like 
fresh that we really do want to keep it this way but obviously we need to make it livable i love this colander this is just a colander but i just friggin loved it so much so we got one of those because you know drain the spaghetti off towel and then these were the mugs that matched the plate um these were for the bathroom we absolutely loved these purely because they actually go with the bin we got but saying that i can't see that bin anywhere and they match these really lovely and they're kind of like the same tonal scale as the plate okay we'll find them in a minute um i also picked up these little grocery bags like i'm sorry they are so freaking cute i'm pretty sure they expand quite a bit as well um but yeah i'm gonna take these on my grocery shopping at least we've got our pan we went for like on the smaller side because there is just two of us like i was like yeah go big go big but realistically we don't need to because normally at home i'm used to cooking for four but there's just two of us now i also this was my mum's fault um i got a pancake pan because i do love pancakes whether I'll make loads here or not, we'll see. Um, but yeah, your classic tray, dish thing. Some of these things are really boring, but it's just what you need um, to survive. No, I'm joking, but you know what I mean. And then we've got a new cushion cover, because basically, in the Ikea, you can get these cushions, and they're all like zipped, so you can just change the covers. So we've got a new cover for one of them. I'm gonna put these two right ones in the wash, because I'm not gonna lie, there is some big tan on them. Um, but they're from the old place. Oh my god, this dish as well. Why do I love this dish so much? It's got all these like um, ribbing, you could say. But I don't know, I just had like a little image of like, I don't know, Jed coming home from work. Jed doesn't come home from work, but like, imagine if he did. And then I'd be there with a little like pasta big tray dish. Ain't that right, boo? Oh, no, don't hear me. <laughs> Never mind. Jed got some hangers. He literally got so many hangers. Like, Oh my god, I don't know how many hangers he got. I'm guessing he must have got some more better than less. More better than less, okay. Well, he got loads of hangers. Then we've got a baby chopping board, because I didn't actually like any of the chopping boards there, so I'm probably gonna order one online. Yeah. And then your classic cutlery. We then got some new pillows to go in the pillowcases that we already have, just because these are quite thin, so we got like thicker ones, just so they like sit uh. sit a bit more outright on the sofa. Some scissors, because yesterday we needed scissors and we didn't have any. Um, cookie jar. I really just wanted to have like just Maryland cookies, chocolate chip cookies in the jar in the kitchen. So, like, I just had a little dream of mine. Jed says I'm trying to make a fat. No, I'm not. You just don't need to eat them all. I will. <laughs> one of these. For some reason, mum won't let me leave Ikea unless I pick up one of these because she's like, oh my God. Like, she has a thing against showers with streaks in. So like, you know after you have a shower, you're meant to like wipe it down. I never do. But she was like, Imogen, you've got to keep it pristine. Like, you, you've got to, you've got to. I was like, okay, you convinced me. I will. We did get a few candles, but we didn't get loads just because Wendy and Seth did kindly get us one yesterday. This one smells so good. I don't really know what it is though. It says jam lick, but it's a picture of like honey, sugar, and vanilla. I feel like it's just vanilla and I'm being really stupid. I feel like I should probably translate that. I genuinely think it would. It smells sweeter than vanilla though, so I don't know whether it's like honey and vanilla or something, but that smells so, so good. We then also got these containers, um, which I just thought would be really good for the fridge, but I just really like them again, the chrome and then like the creamish gray type seals. I thought they would just be really nice for the fridge. I really, really want to have one of those really organized fridge and it might be really like OCD. But have you ever seen the um, TikToks and people like slide in like the drinks and the food and then you've got the fruit section and art. Oh, I want, but I don't know if it'll happen. Dust on a brush. Why can't I think of the words? What is this? Toilet brush stick and holder. <laughs> I don't know. This isn't a necessity for me, but it's a necessity for Jet. I'll tell you that. Oh my god, that was so bad. Oh my god, did that. I've actually fully just grated a piece of my skin off. Oh my god, that's such a small cut, but I always feel like the smallest cuts sting the most. Oh my god, I can't believe I just did that. Anywho. Oh, bloody hell, my finger. They match. That's what I was trying to sell you. I was like, And yeah, I think that concludes this haul. Um, oh, one last thing. No, two last things. Um, boiling pan with a boiling, boiling lid. No, just a steaming lid. And then two more things. 
Um, I don't know when we picked up these, but um, baby sharp knives and a steel something that's not going to burn your counter. I can't remember what they're called. Cool. Now we're just going to pack it all away. Um, and yeah, I will catch up with you shortly. I'm literally so shattered now. Got a bit of a headache coming, so I'm just going to try and hydrate myself before bed. But yeah, I will love you and leave you there. Thank you for watching um, to the end, if you're still here. Um, I love how pretty it is at night as well. Again, you can't see much of the reflection. Please do let me know what kind of like flat apartment bits you want to see um i'm not really quite sure what content to do other than obviously i've done this vlog just let me know just let me know obviously i am home from bali now i've got the girls italy trip in a few weeks but it's the 20th so actually not that long um but other than that yeah do let me know what content you want to see from me because i feel like i've done a lot of vlogging and yeah okay right uh, subscribe comment like down below you know the drill um peace